keeping three strikers in their starting 11. So Evan Akuku, Dean Holsworth and Marcus Gale up front for the Dons. Could leave Wimbledon shorthanded in midfield, but you can rely on Vinnie Jones to do the job of two players. He kept in the side tonight. Manchester United include an attack with Andy Cole and Eric Cantona. David Beckham plays too. He'll play in the centre of midfield, as does Ryan Giggs. Those four alone should prove to be a handful for any defence. And United's defence, there's a recall for Ronnie Johnson, who missed the first match at Old Trafford for injury. Cantona, Cole and Giggs all ready for the kickoff. Roy Keane is forward inside the centre circle too. It's Manchester United who get this FA Cup tie underway. This is Wimbledon's 10th cap tie of the season. They've won five and drawn four. Wimbledon already through to the semi-finals of the League Cup. And they progress now in the FA Cup. And it must feel like a home game for Manchester United because all the noise they can hear is from their own supporters. This is Roy Keane, dominated by many of the match in last year's final against Liverpool. Pat Jones throws it short. Keane is there, first over for Manchester United. Gale knocks it into the box, looking for Efe Nakuku. Jones with a cross. And Robbie Earl will have to retrieve the ball. Leon Arnson tackled by Popolski. Good football here by Wimbledon. That's Dean Holsworth. Leon Arnson. Nakuku! Manchester United appeal for offside, but Evan Akuku wasn't waiting for an offside flag. Well, he might have been level then. Dennis Irwin was caught between marking two Wimbledon players, and he left Evan Akuku, who was free to help that ball towards the Manchester United goal. Look at the despair on the face of Joe Kinnear. Put out by Pallister, Manchester United have just steadied the boat a little bit in the last five minutes. Look a good deal more composed now, this is Cantona. He's round Jones, lovely back heel to Cole. This is Giggs. That's Cantona who felt he was pushed there. And the ball is smuggled clear by the Wimbledon defence. Neville, still Neville, great save by Sullivan. And Manchester United have suddenly lapped up a couple of years effortlessly. Good save by Sullivan quickly to react to that one. Beckham to Cantona. Back to Beckham once again. Giggs. Cunningham backpedaling. It ricocheted off Cunningham. Cole! Great football by Manchester United. Andy Cole, he first to react. Giggs cross, ricocheted. Cunningham, and it was a very good save in the end by Neil Sullivan in the Wimbledon goal to deny Andy Cole a goal. Cunningham will take the throw. That's a great ball to Cole. Cantona waiting in the middle. And Keane wanting to know, and Cantona wanting to know why the ball wasn't cut back. I'm not sure Andy Cole was ever going to score from that sort of distance. The angle was always going to defeat him as he took the ball away from Blackwell. 
Sullivan going to have the near post given anyway. All knocking it forward. And this is Dean Holdsworth. A cuckoo is square of him. It really was another very good chance. Wimbledon. Jones now. Gale. Evan Okuku. Terrific cross in towards Leonardson. Who got there ahead of Beckham. Couldn't make a positive contact with the ball. Give Wimbledon the lead. Good football here by Wimbledon. And Leonardson on side. If he'd made a contact. I suspect the home side would have taken the lead. Oh, he can't bear to look, can he? Holdsworth! Just needed a little bit more. 
of purchase on his header. It was uh, another big, big throw by Vinnie Jones. Ronnie Johnson easily beaten by Dean Holdsworth. Michael might have been struggling here. Uh, this header being a couple of feet the other way. Cantona looking for Cole. Giggs. Well stopped by Chris Perry. Manchester United their turn to apply the pressure on the Wimbledon goal. And in a third round replay, it's Woking 1, Coventry 1. That's Baborski, oh, wonderful save by Sullivan. And it appeared almost certain Manchester United would take the lead with that Pallister header. a sensational piece of goalkeeping. Any doubts now that Neil Sullivan is of international quality have been dispelled. His reflexes there have saved Wimbledon. Jake and his side really have acquitted themselves well once again against the leading lights. In the English Premier League. Cunningham. What nil to Wimbledon. Marcus Gale scores. And Wimbledon aimed towards Ram. first goal in the FA Cup and what a crucial one it could be it might put out the holders Manchester United it was a super cross and this time Gale was unmarked and the leading goal scorer of Wimbledon bulleted that header past Peter Schmeichel Wimbledon 20 minutes away from making the sports headlines in tomorrow morning's newspapers. That's Beckham. A deflection of Sullivan to dive on the ball. Well, this was dangerous. I think uh, Sullivan wasn't worried about Beckham's shot. By the time it had ricocheted off Vinnie Jones, it was spinning. Sean the man, the owner of Wimbledon on the left of your picture. Mick Jagger to his right. Well, at the moment it's Manchester United who can't get no satisfaction. They can't get no goal either. Oh! That could have been one for the Christmas video. This really was oh, a mistake by Manchester United. We'll put it politely. Roy Keane. Solskjaer. Still Solskjaer. He wriggled inside, made the space for the shot. And one of Manchester United's most consistent scorers this season. Lifts another chance over the top. Terrific footwork. Left Kimball for dead. Look at the number of red shirts waiting for the ball. This is Cantona. Gates, McClare, Cole. Beckham! Well, it was like a red tide sweeping through the Wimbledon defence. So many talented players have got forward here as the ball fell invitingly to Beckham. He 
put money on him, forcing Sullivan into a save. Eric Cantor now. Tackle by Jones. Keane once again. The space here for Manchester United. Kicks with the cross. Cole! And for all that pressure and domination of this second half, it just won't go in for Manchester United. It was a super cross. It invited a header. The header better than that one. Still 1 0 to Wimbledon. And they're going to take an age over this free kick. Study every blade of grass around the ball. Vinny Jones wallops it in. And Cuckoo, it hit his own player. It hit John Goodman. Oh, that could have been curtains for Manchester United. Is there time for one last attack? Here's Brian McClare. Giggs. Captain us there. It's going to be a corner. Oh, this is nail biting stuff. And Schmeichel's gone forward as a makeshift centre forward. Schmeichel, he scored! Would you believe it? Peter Schmeichel equalises for Manchester United with virtually the last kick of the game. Was he offside? I think he was. Wimbledon claimed the offside. Wow, what an incredible ending to this game. We've played more than three minutes of stoppage time. Wimbledon ever closer to beating Manchester United. It's all over, Wimbledon are through, and Joe Kinnear's side has done it. Dean Holsworth congratulates the goal scorer. Vinnie Jones has led the side magnificently. They'll be celebrating this win for a long time. They'll be talking about this win for a long time. Wimbledon have knocked out Manchester United. Final score, Wimbledon 1, Manchester United 0.